welcome to electronic systems and devices product demonstration this is leak 901d process indicator it's a jumbo display the height of the display is 6 inch and there are four digits in it uh, we'll first go through the settings mode for the settings mode you have to press the function uh, up arrow and then the function key the first option you get is dcpt that is for the decimal point it is selectable you can select it position of the decimal point anywhere you want press enter it goes to the next uh, setting which is input lower limit this corresponds to the uh, 4 to 20 milliampere uh, reading for the 4 milliampere whatever is the reading you want you have to enter it here next is the input upper limit this is for the 20 milliampere corresponding reading okay we we'll just keep it 100.0 this is output lower limit this is uh, this one doesn't have the retransmission output but this is for the 4 to 20 retransmission output enter offset uh, just in case there is some error in the uh, sensor you can correct that error by feeding in an offset which can be uh, from minus 1.20 uh, to plus 1.20 we will keep it zero now address is for modular party communication this is the slave id address name then border is selectable from 1200, 2400, 4800, 9600. We'll keep it 9600 now. That's the settings mode. Then we go to calibration mode. For calibration, you have to press the down arrow and the function key. It will ask for the password. The default password for calibration mode is 191. We are using Electronics 135, which is a milliampere and millivolt source simulator. To feed the input, it will give the 4 milliampere input now in the calibration mode 4.00. You press enter, it will go to the next, that is the span reading. Then you feed the 20 milliampere reading 20.00. Okay, we'll press enter. This completes the calibration. Now we had kept the upper limit as 100.0, so it was showing 100. We'll just we'll feed 12.0, which is a midpoint. For 12.00, we'll get reading somewhere near 50. 50.0. Okay. Now we'll just go to check the dimensions of the instrument. The depth of this is around 50 uh, 70 mm right and height is height of the is 215 mm okay uh, we'll just see how the mounting is done for the mounting uh, there are two L brackets here so you can do the wall mounting or you can just hang it from the roof there's a strong cable given with it it's a chain actually and for you'll see this Inputs here. And where we feed the inputs? We have a 24 volt DC supply which you can use to power up the transmitter. Thank you for watching the demonstration.